Hi, my name is Ms. Leroy. I am the principal here at Whitnall Middle School and we are happy to present you with this video to welcome you to our school. Some advice that we have for incoming fifth graders and parents. I guess the main advice would be to keep remembering that you are going to be nervous and keep remembering that that is okay because everybody else is going to be afraid also. So there's really nothing to worry about. I know that's easy to say, but we will have all kinds of activities and supports in place for new students, fifth grade, whether it's fifth graders or new older students, seventh, eighth graders. And we will have students that can help you out, adults that can help you out. So the best thing we can say is welcome to our school and don't be afraid to come forward with questions. I guess the best advice I can give you is just relax. Um, many students have many questions, many parents have many questions about the middle school. Um, we realize that it is a new environment, a new um, uh, part of life for you. Um, you know, moving classes, um, meeting new people, um, there's, there's just so many things that are going to be new for you. And just be patient with yourself and with others and, and you'll get through the middle school just fine. The other piece of advice I might give is um, get involved. Get involved in the school, um, whether it's through student council, whether it's through clubs, different activities, um, different sports. Um, the more things that you get involved with at the middle school, um, the more friends you're going to meet and um, the better things are going to go for you. But again, just relax and enjoy your, your stay at the middle school. You can ask her about any questions or anything that you need help with. Mr. Borden's office. This is Ms. Leroy's office. Your counselors, Mr. Gableman and Mrs. Larson. This is office, so if you don't feel good or anything like that, you can come here. This is Ms. Shamo Quaker's room. She teaches science and social studies. This is Ms. Hamill's room. She teaches science and social studies. This is Ms. Kusick's room. She teaches social studies and math. This is Mr. Siebert's room. He teaches math and social studies. This is Ms. Roper's room. She teaches language arts. Social studies. This is Ms. Granberg's room. She teaches social studies and labor arts. A typical day at Whitnall is that you have four core classes, which is your math, language arts, science, and social studies, and you have two electives. My favorite thing is the teachers. My favorite thing is that we have our own iPads. More independence. And my favorite thing is that you get to choose what you want for lunch. Like, you get to choose if you want, like, the regular lunch or like, pizza or burger. Hi, we are our 6th grade video team. What makes what no. middle school unique is the students, the teachers. It's fun. Fun and engaging gym classes. 
Individuality. Offers beginning engineering program in seventh grade. Great band program. There are many instruments to play. iPads. I wish I would have known that passing time is not that difficult. I wish I would have known how easy it is to open your locker. gum at the middle school, but don't spit it in the bubblers because that's disgusting. Remember your locker combination. Know where you're going after the bell rings. Never be afraid to approach a 7th or 8th grade student. We'd be glad to help. Middle school life fact. Don't be afraid to talk to people you don't know. Make sure you clean out your binder every so often. The cleaner you are, the easier life will be. Take a picture of your schedule and set it as your lock screen on your iPad. Use your study hall time wisely. Always have gum with you. You're going to need it. Use your iPad appropriately. Use three ring binders instead of accordion folders. Your teachers take time to hole punch them for you.
team. My favorite thing about middle school is being able to adapt easily to the middle school. Being able to be more independent. Being able to join new clubs. Being able to use iPads instead of textbooks. Being able to meet people from new schools and make new friends. Being able to pick your classes. Not staying in the same classroom the whole day. Being able to have more lunch choices. Being able to talk to friends in between classes. And floor surfing. <laughs> This virtual tour proudly brought to you by 6th, 7th, and 8th grade video teams.